Hey, hey folks, it's Alex here from Hanneman Ironworks, and uh, today it's going to be a little bit of a different video. Uh, I will be in the shop, I'll be forging something, however it's raining outside, um, you might be able to hear it right now. I'm in the garage, it's insulated in the garage and it doesn't have tin roof, so um, I'll be working out there, I'll be listening to music, um, however, can't really film great audio out there, just because it's rain on a tin roof and you guys would be hard to hear me. I walk in there and the sound amplifies pretty bad. So, um, I will not be doing any, uh, you know, voicing during the video. So I'll be sh showing the process. Um, I will be putting screen, uh, text of what I'm doing. Um, I could do voiceover. However, it doesn't usually sound great when I do voiceovers. So I'll be putting uh, text up and we'll be trying a different video format today. Um, what I'll be making is a spatula for the grill. Um, just another, uh, video. I will be making a few other videos today as well. Um, kind of depends on what videos and what time I have. So I'll be working on a spatula right now. Um, however, I'll probably be working on other things too. It's going to be fairly simple. I'm going to start off with a uh, rebar. I'm going to square it out. Again, if you want to go uh, figure out how to do that, um, it's very simple. Square it out. Watch what one of my, not the last one, but the two before it shows the process of squaring up rebar. Um, but it's fairly simple. So I'm going to start with square stock. This is what you guys will see. I'll be making a spatula. So hang along with me, uh, try a different video out, and I'll come back with you here when I have it done.
guys, so here we have it. It's a little spatula, just flipping burgers, pancakes, whatever you please. I believe this will be primarily used for burgers. Um, here it is. Got just two standard old rivets in there. And this uh, piece actually came off a three by three piece of tubing I got with my anvil when I bought it. I got like eight foot of uh, three by three, one eighth inch uh, tubing. Um, obviously the handle was made from rebar and yeah so oh and the rivets were store-bought material um, just quarter inch got it from Home Depot but there it is um, I haven't measured it I believe it's gonna be close to 19 inches uh, the physical handle was I think 14 and 3 fourths and this is was five inches long it may be a little bit shorter but 14 and obviously it sends in just a little bit shooting for 19 around the money hopefully I haven't measured it but that would match the set pretty well but here it is and i just textured this just a little bit with a ball pin nothing fancy but uh there we have it so thanks for watching um i haven't decided what video i'm going to do next if it's going to be grill or if it's going to be not grill series related um but i have a few other videos i've already recorded because other things have piqued my interest other than making grill things. So, um, yeah, so stick along. Uh, there will be more videos, especially of the grill variety. I'm not sure if it's going to be next week, though. So um, if you haven't already, please drop a like on this video. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, catch you guys all on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.